What up, world? Sunny Bamboo. This is ATL. This is Don't Flop USA. If y'all are in the building one time, make some noise. I got a crazy cast of co-hosts with me right now. I got my man Little Town Blow, Spit That Heat. I got my man John John, you already know. Gaddis, d -Rex. Let's get it, man. This one is going to be crazy. To my right, y'all make some noise out of D.C. for my man Coma. And to the left, <laughs> representing Spit That Eat to the fullest, my man Chef Trez, y'all give it up! Yeah. Now just so y'all know, this one was taken on very short notice, alright? So give it up one time for both of them for stepping in and performing for y'all on only a few days, alright? We're gonna have round one on combo, whenever you're ready, bro, let's get it. Y'all about to hear some real shit! Oh. This ain't the Rick Rap Show! Straight fucking! I'm about to cook shit to show him how this click clack go! You'll get X'd out when I draw and put a round in the square like tic-tac-toe! Man, you come in with any dumbass shit like that tonight, I'm gonna put more hands in during this battle than Milltown Blow. <laughs> Years, but don't test the ether that's still in my system. Don't get it fucked up. You'll get punched drunk if you go against the grain like prohibition. <laughs> Homie, listen. This ain't the first time I had to put down some fake ass revolutionary clown. It's just business. You can't use the illusion that you're Martin Luther if you're more of a Martin Lawrence. It's important you know the difference. <laughs> so put your fist up and tell me how I'm responsible for all your struggles. Bring that racist shit to Don't Fly. We got all fucking day. Just know that whatever you brought today. You can wrap your trash presents, but you still gotta play the part of Marvin Gaye on Father's Day. I'm killing it. Ah. A modern day martyr, I clawed my way through the dark and stayed to carve my name into the altar where the gospel was often so all the gods and saints could watch me lodge the blade in Proverbs' face. But you are not the same. You thought you brought some flames, but you washed up and you lost soon as you walked up and got on this stage. And don't look at them for help. You killed yourself. They are not to blame and they warned you. So while they pray for you, I pray on you. Look in my eyes, you can tell the vision is to smack you until the static stops you. One of this white noise when I got you. And I watch you in your costume. You play yourself on tape, but if you rewind and stop, it was obvious that Adi Boom boxed you. Exhibit B, verse perp, you said, I got that ass eating floor, I spit crap. <laughs> Jeff Trez, the president of penmanship. That wasn't a choke. There's just no punchline, tough guy. You actually said that shit. <laughs> but what else would you expect from him? He scripts these simple films for children and keeps the kids in mind when he directs the shit. So I don't give a fuck how high you are rated in the PGs. If you knew how a real G movie, he wouldn't respect this shit. What do I gotta put it in subtitles or something? That bar was full of questionable references and homosexual suggestions. <laughs> so you can find this body for me. But the way this worked out, I gotta be the person to train you. With the reps so small, you gotta flex those arms to get your weight up. So catch the fade and get your face cut. You'll get hit two times before you get ate up. Keep an open mind, chef. Or I'll take this razor blade and push it straight to your shape up. What the fuck do you rap about that makes you a pro? Tools? Man, please. I know a hungry rapper back home that asked me to make him a beat and he said you can use logic and reason but if he cocks the machine then all that you'll hear is the clap between the kicks while he beats you to death. Woo! Uh, the whole DMV is in this bitch but I'll still leave you your head. Just tell fucking Danger Zone if he doesn't give me that token white boy spot in writer's block then he's coming next. Time is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I said, uh, I say, honestly, bro, this spit that heat in the building. Yeah, niggas know I be rapping elite. And you right, in the ring, I really like to rap about niggas clapping the heat. But all that racist shit really don't matter to me. I got a white dude that'll clap twos just to be master prestige. I say, ah, oh, that's the Call of Duty shit. But it's crazy. That was still all right. But ain't nothing you can laugh at. You said you ain't drunk in years. I give you a shot from the 40 to bring your past back. <laughs> I say, 
I say short ho bitch, it's a rap, this dork bogus, I'm armed, focused, and you, of course hopeless, throw a tomahawk, crack through your shit and cave your torso in, you'll catch an axe out of nowhere, now that's how you take a battle on short notice, we had some... I said, we had since Wednesday to write. When Sonny called, I wasn't mad with it. I ain't had shit to do. Actually, I was glad with it, but all Thursday I was writing. I ain't even eat. That's bad business. So please show respect and let it be Thanksgiving for this ass whipping. I say, I'm a thorough guy. And the real niggas and your girl eyes And you trying to battle a giant when you a squirrel size? Well, I'ma get you some views This shit gonna have the whole world wild Lamar Odom I'ma make this coma worldwide Talk to this nigga right now Talk to this nigga right now I say, look, nigga, on some real shit, I might pop on you, catch you slipping and do you bad. I got the drop on you like handgun here with a sniper. When I aim, you better hope you don't get too close to spot coma. Because if I lose sight, you know what's coming next. The clock coma. <laughs> I said, I got a long nine, long john, the heat with me, I blow mine, I click and squirt, it'll lift your shirt, it got blows mine, the ambulance. Uh, how you want it like that? <laughs> <laughs> I said, okay. 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 Hold on. I said, the ambulance will take forever to get you, you laying cold dime, so this click Rick Van Winkle, cause these bullets gonna be in coma a long time, you, I said, I said, you'll catch a headshot. But it looked like a leg shot, cause after the head shot, first thing y'all seen was the nigga legs drop. <laughs> I said, y'all remember the Flintstones? I'll shoot this bitch and y'all would think Will Mong get left with a red top, or I'll catch him sleeping and start squeezing and get everybody in that bed, bed bro. Come on, that shit's easy, man. Hey, but that's the hard though. God damn, y'all thanks for the noise for these two. So in this whole cast full of actors, you should know your role, you chose to play the bitch. The one Neo next to Niobe, Jada Smith. Over the years, I've seen so many of these same cats like a Matrix glitch, so save this shit. You're just another fucking clone with a gun, Agent Smith, and it makes me sick. Can you lift my shirt at some point? That would make me feel better. <laughs> Uh, you're just another fucking clone with a gun, Agent Smith, and it makes me sick. You know the guy that backed out on me, Prover? All right. You and Pro are just a bunch of vampires and bloodsuckers. Enough to stand up by the fans and tired of you motherfuckers. We can't survive till this cancer dies or it's cut from us. I can't stand these guys. I want something other than blood running or gun bust or stunt doubles. Nobody's running from you. You're not holding weight, and we know you're fake. And if you two can't give birth to something new, then why the fuck should you and Pro create? Hold up, wait. That's fucking bullshit. Hold up, wait. You heard. Hold up, wait. You heard. Hold up, wait. What else? Your heart has a ponytail. You know you're frail, Chef. And talking all that hammer shit will only get you nailed, Chef. I don't give a fuck if you're dumb, blind, or deaf. I learned how to speak with my hands and leave a message in the bumps. I hope you're good at reading Braille, Chef. So let me let you in on a secret. When corny motherfuckers like you come on the screen with that mean shit, that doesn't mean shit like, hey, yo, it's trash, you already know what it is. <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> I hear what you mean, bitch. <laughs> it's like you say that shit because you heard some other gay ass bitch say that shit, then you flip it around, do a heater, and say some dumb ass racist shit. Like, you could call me whatever you want, but if I even mention the word black, you get hysterical now, so we'll make an agreement. If I get drunk as fuck tonight and forget everything that happens, instead of saying black, I'll just say I African American doubt. So fuck the, <laughs> fuck the when, where, and how. You cannot weather this brainstorm, don't step to me. Post traumatic stress, I never forget an enemy. You get pure evil, then the sequel. I'll stomp your head and leave, then come back and fuck you up again like a repressed memory. Stop testing me. Oh, I want to hear all your sharp gun bars, but the blade serrated edge doesn't care if you save them in the air or if you save them in your breath. I'm trying to help you open up. You get the point? This bayonet will make you say it with your chest. Stop playing with the best. 
You knew better than to do this shit. You're looking at the rookie of the year. Shining, I crashed head first through the door. Jack Nicholson Jr., bitch, too. Talk to him, dude. Come on, dude. Talk to him, dude. Yo, Jersey. 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 I don't think that what you rapping is real. Like, honestly, my nigga, you honestly average for real. You use bars for that pro dude. I wrote bars like a pro dude in four days. That should show y'all who really has actual skills. See, this nigga's not like that. And I hate this shit. If he says all this black, you the one that's thinking all this racist shit. I say, I ask myself after I agree, why the fuck did you say yes to this coma cat? Sonny almost broke my phone when you sent me that footage and I heard Coma rap like, dog, I will punch the shit out you. Y'all will see Coma Nat, cause I will pop his motherfucking teeth like when you Coma Nat. I'ma see. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I say, I say, I say, I'm a sick toter. I walk up to your youngin' and get your kids toasters. Now they gon' see a seed in a bag like mid smokers. Headshot. I say, headshot. Your soul has no support like you rockin' thin loafers. Show the deuce. You'll still get tookin' out. It's the big joker. It's white as blush. I say, I say, I say it's writer's block. Niggas know that we spit fire. It's like everybody think they can beat us till it's time to battle and we get by you. But they ain't trying to let us shine. They rather promote them weak bitch liars. So how the fuck we gonna teach these motherfuckers if they don't free them writers? I got a hot I say I got a hot head. Don't be the one I get that airing on. Cause I'll come to your block and blow in the crib like that air is on. Have you and your bitch in the same casket sharing stones. But you don't want that? Say the Sharon Stone part. I said Sharon Stone. I said how you and your bitch in the same casket, Sharon Stones, but you don't want that. I see the bitch in coma like Sharon Stone. I rap the same everywhere. I don't know my style. Just stick with me. Niggas be like you should rap like this here and that there, but no matter where, mine fit the league. I'm not certain, but it's like basketball. No matter where we guard them, Ray Allen shoot the same to hit the three. It applies here. I stay the same form because it keeps me consistent. See, I'm school. Same form. I say I'm schooling niggas, letting them know it ain't a fucking game. If you don't want to get robbed, I say be bold with your right exposed, then tuck your chain. Sonny, next time I need a plate and not a fucking lane, because I'll sleep your stupid ass and put you inside your fucking name, nigga. <laughs> Word. Hey, give it up one more time for Chef stepping up on last notice, man. The yes, sir. Make some noise, y'all. Talk to him, shorty. So this is battle rap. <laughs> y'all done yet? Yeah. All right. So this is battle rap. When a tough guy's get uncomfortable, when it's vulnerable, or from the soul, and they get the impression there's pain in the picture and draw the line. But that's not what true heart is made of. So I just push my hands and confess, and then I let the fans catch the shit. Okay. Uh, no, I said, impression is painting a picture. I draw the lines. Is that not what true art is made of? I just push my hands on the canvas, and I let the fans sketch the shit. Come on. Talk, talk. Right. But this is battle rap. They're expecting shit like, you could catch him for that recklessness if he pops fly with that rowdy shit, or call him out at first. Or you can check him in a second, cause when he's only good for a non bar, the foot's in his mouth. Just look at the crowd, you're on the rousey shit, now the knockout's even worse. And I'm not here to prove that I can put all that garbage in a verse. Or that I can put a punch on paper like I'm clocking out of work. But to an artist, what's it worth? When they forget my first two in one second, but I'm remembered for what I'm talking about in the third. So in response to all the shit I've heard, whether I'm homeless or not, our coma's not an alcoholic since his birth, he's a coma not. He got so high that he died when he was falling back to earth. When I was crawling through the dirt, an urchin looking for my works as a monster, I made a promise that if I ever saw rebirth and resurface, I'd find a purpose. And now I'm here with words to make sure that this bird got what he deserved. Man, you got a lot of nerve. You say Chef Trez is the greatest, but he left the next generation looking for a leader when they need one. You're just another fake ass rapper that's responsible for all the kids that got a sentence but couldn't read one. Cause you can't teach peace and preach guns without looking disgrace. So the next time you see a kid liking a poster, retweeting the tweet, 
Tell him to get the fuck off Facebook and put a fucking book in his face. Oh, Cause he looked up to you. And as a result, he's only focused on money and drugs and guns and where the girls are. And that was more law, uh, poorer than the scores in his report cards. He only thinks in black versus white, so he's eager when the war starts. And he missed the shine of all the stars in the world because he was blinded by a world star. Mm. <laughs> Talk that white Talk to him, shorty. I am white. I am white Lux. You heard No fucking question. <laughs> Get that nigga white Lux. Yeah. Well, maybe it's... All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Bring him back. He missed the shine of all the stars in the world because he was blinded by a world star. But maybe it's make believe. I never check. Because on one hand, you got a white man that says, I don't understand why they're blaming me for slavery, but there's evidence that it never left, it never changed the same story. It's still about whips and chains. He just switched the name to Maybach and Jacob and convinced the kids to pay for them. Then on the other hand, I got a protester in my face saying, hands up, stop shooting me. Throwing bottles of rocks at my car when I'm with my daughter, but you can look at my roots and see that Black Lives Matter is not a concept that's new to me, but it confuses me. Cause they'll say it to my face because of my skin color But won't say it to their brother dealing drugs in their own community But fuck the unity, this is battle rap It's not the place to be politically correct It's about blatant hatred and engaging in disrespect If there's that word I'm not supposed to say That word that was said in the air when some boy was so scared And they put that chain around his neck Okay. And then they told him around the neighborhood for tour blocks and they carved that word in his forehead before they dumped his body on his parents' lawn and instead of blaming them, they blamed themselves instead. Okay. And the redneck confederate veterans that killed him said this word when they raised the flag and hold it high. But they say it's not about racism, it's not hatred, it's all about southern pride. That word with two G's in the middle and two letters on either side. But this is battle rap, so I'm going to say this shit because it fits in the picture, so fuck it. You're just another motherfucking faggot. Scram, like, you would need an ambulance. Like, honestly, Coma, you don't stand a chance. You're right. I keep peace and preach, pre uh, preach peace because this shit go hand in hand, but it's some different shit. Like, when you freestyle on short notice, sometimes you might fuck up when you skip and shit, but I'm crazy, ridiculous shit. Strap a napalm bomb to your mom's a clitoris. Like, ain't this some shit? <laughs> Two white boys in a back popping beer, like who gives a shit? Like, I'm still freestyling because you were speaking that white, black, all that other shit, right? But listen, that gangster talk and all that other talk, nigga, I don't try to be. I'm fucking up, but nigga, you a bitch and coma, please don't lie to me. Did you see me with that black life matter shit? I mean, black life matter, bitch, but if you ain't see me on the screen, it don't apply to me. We need to win this battle right now. It is Black Life Matters, but I'm on some big shit. White dude with a big clip. I got a white dude with a black gun. That's how he mix kids. See you. Oh. Oh. I said, but this one ain't your back, but I still got retweets. I say, uh. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> I say, I can't lie, bro. You be rapping tough as hell. Like, you really think you'll beat me up or that you'll bust the shell. But if shit really got real, your ass would be the first to fucking tell. And besides the fact that you look like you on ice, man, you really resemble Chuck Liddell. You ain't stopping me. <laughs> I said, you ain't stopping me. Right. See how my state acknowledged me? 4-5, deuce, deuce, 9, 357, let's play the lottery. Bullets go inside of me. <laughs> Bitch, nigga, big suck of the gun, cock in your mouth. You practice side of me. I'm a real nigga, go. You can come cooler with Chef. But you just gotta smoke weed, man. I ain't about to fool with no meth. I know you might. <laughs> I say, I know you. I say, I say, I know you white and I'm black. But that skin color shit is bull at its best, cause everyone can agree. We all red once a bullet connect. I had your girl. I was controlling her bra. She was holding me, I was holding her jaw. But she wasn't sucking right, like it was a hole in a straw. I said, fuck it, grab hold of my floor. I said, I said, fuck it, grab hold of my floor and blew it through the sheetrock. Now it wasn't just gory, but also glory. Cause it's nothing but a fucking hole in a wall. I'm like, I said, 
I say, I'm ahead by a long way. Thank you, Stewie, when the kid's spitting. You the lowest nigga on this card. But thank you, doping and shit hitting. No lying, you grinding. Because lately, white dog been tripping. And I get that whole family got scheme just to say that you look like Chris Griffin. <laughs> I said, you ain't surviving this, you should scram. I take five one, I say, I ain't that. You got him, you got him. Pick it up. I said, you ain't surviving this, you should scram. I take five when I start to blam. You wasn't expecting these punches. Like I'm fighting you for my friends. It's more to come back and shooting in the open. So I'm hiding behind a van, Luke Kang style. Duck down, just firing from my hands. Uh, okay. You with it, you with it. I'm gonna cook another nigga time to clean up the dishes. Y'all make some money, fuck me Learn to walk a fine line, never learn to write one. Oh, it's all freestyle. Piss off, tourist. That final lick was written like a hip hop purist. But mm. wait, he kind of sounds like his Dub RC type of rants. So either he's writing then, or he's freestyling now. <laughs> <laughs>